The fire, which started at about 5 a.m., sent out thick smoke billowing into the air, attracting residents and passers-by in and around Ugbawa area of Benin City. Vehicular movement was affected as motorists quickly diverted in search of alternative routes. The truck and a Passat CL were consumed in the fire. Owner of the Passat CL, an eyewitness, and others narrated how the incident occurred. As the one just enter the episode, the truck of Dutch, on our way to the come drag. Come this side. Yes. So on my mind, is here. I must escape. So we don't do anything. We will jam it. We were able to rescue the two motor boys, but the driver was trapped down there. So we tried to rescue the driver. That's why. Uh, that's how we had a fire explode. Both are. Yeah. So that we are around a few minutes to six now we hear noise. Boo! That noise when we hear boo. Normally vehicles they fall for the road like that. So we just feel the normal something. Not quite ten minutes. That be the explosion. Fire services of the UBTH, Uniben, Nigerian Army. NPDC and officials of the Edo State Fire Service, led by the director Franklin Agbalaho, were on the ground to contain the fire. My truck has just left now for the fourth time to go on the field. The other sister agencies are here, Edo State, NNPDC, Nigeria Army, we are open here to control the fire. The only opportunity is that a soil was lost inside the fire truck. The tanker was carrying diesel, and uh, the luck we had was that it was no fuel, and it, no, it's about uh, 50,000 liters. And if it, it, if it was fuel, it would have been serious. So it was, it was when the car caught fire, that fire came out to engage the, fire, uh, the, the tanker. We have not gotten detailed information of where the battle of the driver of the advance of the leg. But as you can see, the fire is subsiding gradually because it was a very tense one. His PMS product that he was carrying and it's very volatile. You can see the rate of spread very fast. Chairman Ego local government, Ege Ugbemudia, who was also on the ground, speaks. I got the call around 6 this morning by my DSS that a tanker fell on the road and is burning. So I now told the police to block everywhere, vehicles coming in and going out within uh, Uwasota and uh, Unibank gates so that we don't have more uh, casualties. Pius Nsogo reporting.